All right, we finally got our Myriad Celestia trail for Sparkle behind the curtain. We're gonna watch the English version and then the Japanese version because I absolutely fell in love with her Japanese voice. It is so good. And I love Sparkle. I know a lot of people are like, oh, she's racist. I hate her. She's such a bad character. I love her, bro. She's like my favorite character in Star Rail right now, personality wise. I'm so intrigued in what she can bring to the story because there's so much mystery behind this character. And I absolutely cannot wait to learn more about her and her backstory and the masked fools in general, because I think they are the most interesting group in Star Rail right now, out of Annihilation Gang, IPC, all, you know, Pentacony, all the above the family. I'm more interested in the masked fools more than anything. They're like the ones that we know the least about so far. So I'm very curious to see if they reveal any of that in this video. <laughs> no shot, bro. That's her. Looks it like doesn't matter looks like Pela. <laughs> who I am off stage. All the audience needs to know. Is yes, that when I'm on stage, I'm just sparkle. It's She's you, so cute. Look at the mask. My beloved mask. My beloved mask. When I'm happy. You're smiling too. When I'm angry. You're still smiling. She's so cute. Look at her. I'm sad. Aww. You keep on smiling. I would never yeah, picture her getting sad after meeting her in the story. I can hide under. Bro, she is so hot. The one wearing the veil. That sparkle. Very interesting. It's you, my beloved mask. When I'm happy, Yo, this song goes hard. <laughs> when I'm angry, she's repeating herself. You're screaming too. When I'm, when sad, I'm sad, you're smiling too. You're crying too. Oh, you're crying too. Oh, the le no, the words changed. You're like a mirror showing my reflection. The one in the mirror that sparkle. Oh, look at the tears on the fox and the kitsune. So is she like an actress in in this world? Like it's they you. think they people just think she's an my actress. Mask. Another mask? Oh my god, dude! That's the thumbnail. When I'm angry, you're I, crying. Oh my god! When I'm sad, you're smiling. You're like a face staring at me. I I'm not sparkle. I'm not spark. No. I I'm a puppet. Sparkle. What? The Does she have multiple, like, so, multiple personality disorder? When I realized life was just a play, I wanted to leave the stage. Because. Oh, so before stage, she was a mass fool, she was an actress. There's an even bigger stage. What do you say? <laughs> I have goosebumps. Who's the real spark? What the hell? Either this is like a take of her having multiple personality disorder, like psychotic, or or she's just saying that she has many faces that she wears with the mask. I, ha I have a feeling it's a take on her possibly having multiple personality disorder because the way that that was going, it felt like it. There's this, um, it's like a paranormal movie, like a horror. I forgot what it is, but it's a dude that has like six personalities and the sixth one the other five never let the sixth one come out because that one's like the demon, like the devil, right? That one's like Satan. So I'm very curious if it's something like that where she has a side of her that is just like, you can't, you don't want to see that side. Let's look at the JP one, dude. This is a very interesting. I think this is the most interesting trailer we have seen. Like that, that just leaves me with so many questions compared to all the other ones. <laughs> I love her Japanese voice actor. The English one's really good too, though. みんなは。みんなは。みんなは。みんなは。みんなは。みんなは。みんなは。みんなは。みんなは。みんなは。みんなは。みんなは。みんなは。みんなは。みんなは。みんなは。みんなは。みんなは。みんなは。みんなは。
That's such a cute shot. The stigmata on her back, man. The masks, the different masks. The different masks are definitely different personalities. See, different mask again. You're like a mirror showing my reflection. What a beautiful shot, man. Oh my god. Sparkle showing number 99. But I'm happy you're screaming. Yo, okay, hold up. I, I gotta see that one again. Dude, that this one is crazy to me. This shot is crazy. What the fuck? It's like leading to all these different other masks. When I'm sad, you're smiling. It's almost like the mask controls her. Yeah, this is so interesting. Dude, that's crazy. So these are all the different plays and stuff that she's done, all the different roles, like different spot. Oh, this one looks like Sushang right here. Look at this one. <laughs> um yeah, what the heck? I'm trying to see if any of the other ones remind me of any other characters. This kind of reminds me of Vilvi a little bit. Um, yeah, dude. I don't know. This is crazy. What the heck? That was very interesting. I, that left me with even more questions than I had before. I, Dude, like I said in the beginning of the video, she is the one that I am most curious about. Like out of everyone we've met in Pentacoin so far, more than more than Black Swan, more than Akron. I pretty much already have Akron figured out. I feel like, um, you know, I I, uh, I feel like I, I, my theory on Akron is uh, is pretty correct. I still got to do a video on that, but dude, this was a great Myriad Celestial Trail. This one was one of my favorites. I think I I think this is one of my favorite ones I've seen out of all the ones that they've done so far. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below. What do you think? Do you think that like she has multiple personality disorder? It kind of feels like. Like, yeah, she's a little psychotic, but I feel like she might actually be, like, you know, mentally unstable. Like, she probably has, a, like, a, a multiple personality disorder. I think that's what they're leading to with this trail. Let me know your thoughts down below in the, in the trail, what you guys think, um, you know, the scenes meant when she kept doing that, you know, repeated. I know there were different plays that she was doing, and, you know, she was repeating herself, but also changing the lines a little bit. Like, when she said, when I'm crying, you're smiling in the beginning. On the last one, she said, when I'm, uh, when I'm crying... Uh, you're 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 angry, you know. So I, I'm curious, uh, what 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 everything meant in this. Like I I, I want to see more about her. And the companion quest for her was not enough. I need to see more. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed this, hit the like button, subscribe if you haven't already, and ring that notification bell to be notified for future videos on Honkai Star Rail, Honkai Back Third, and Wuthering Waves, of course, and many many more uh, games that are being coming out very shortly. We got Rebirth coming out in a couple days. I'll be doing some guides on that. And also, solo leveling is probably going to have a beta next month, so I'm probably going to be doing that as well. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you all on the next video.